Hey guys, happy Sunday. Welcome back to Tales from the Pythians, our Sunday night live Twitch stream of Solasta, Crown of the Magister, Temple of Evil module by Silverquick up there in the right square, the top right square beside the lovely, the only, Q. <laughs> I am Greg, Jose is to my right in the squares there, and we are going to get into it. Um, we are like, we like everything worked out perfectly. We just all got in right as the timer was going down for whomever was there watching the timer go down. Um, just a reminder, if you miss these live, go over to YouTube. Usually the video is posted the following day, so I try to keep it at Mondays. Um, like it, subscribe it, uh, but stay here. Subscribe here too. Come back, see us, join us, communicate with us, um, have fun with us, laugh with us, drink with us, cry with us. We, we'll stop yeah, we there. We don't really hear know from you. We really don't know y'all too well, really. We can't go beyond that, I guess. But, uh, yeah, how you guys doing? Not bad, not bad. I see where we left off. We just came up from the third floor, and we're in the top level of the tower. I almost didn't remember our game, so we ended up coming up here to fight off uh, all the things, except I don't think we searched the back room over here. You know, I noticed uh, Trip was online. I wonder if he's the one that was waiting for the stream. Oh, he, uh, yeah, he <laughs> might possible, be. Possible. He might be. Trip, what's up? If that's you. If you are indeed Trip. Are you? <laughs> are you? Uh, <laughs> all right, I'm going to check the journal real quick just to remind myself. Um, we got two that's returns to Mother Scrings. Because we uh, have yeah, found yeah, the temple. Do, uh, <laughs> yep. We did. Yep. Now that I think about it, might not be a bad idea to go back there since uh, we we're back up to the first floor. Yep. Yep, we might as well get the load screens out at the beginning. Which, by the way, uh, I, we forgot to search and get this stuff out of our chest and look at the other things in this room back here. Oh, yeah, that trap chest. That sounds Is that like... where we came up? The hole in the floor? Yep, that's the one. That sounds okay. like a job for Kern. Yeah, we came up and where that bag was was the the one main guy. And all his cronies were in that room. Dude, tomorrow all the, the new Solasta DLC comes out. Very excited uh, about yes, that. I forgot about tomorrow. That. So the next time we any of us start something, we'll be starting with the new stuff. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, I think that Bard's going to be pretty good in that one, too. Oh, yeah, I think so, too. Oh, yeah. All right, we've got a bunch of coins, four amethysts, an emerald, and a tower journal. Hmm. Okay. Uh, and there looks see like there's something here. in the corner there, too, but go ahead. Let's read it. This, would be, this appears to be the journal of the commander of the mercenaries in the ruined tower. It generally covers day-to-day -day events, but does contain some inter interesting tidbits. While the lesser elemental evils vie for control in the upper dungeon levels of the temple, the upper Falrenith does not get involved with either they nor the greater temple below. He is hoping to curry favor with the nameless one directly, or does he work for a third party? Perhaps what Falrenith, uh, Falrenith seeks is the secret to some unknown power he has yet to reveal. He was already a powerful mage on his own right, and I know that he has made secret deals with the demons. That little closet he calls Critch is always by his side. Well, he pays well, so I'm not going to ask. The half-orc he keeps as his lieutenant, Smigmal, Smigmal Redhand, I believe he goes by, is terrifying. I hear he was trained by the Grimblades. I've seen him assassinate very strong targets without even being able to draw their blade. Mm. We didn't we uh, Smigmal Red Blade? Yeah, we fought it. Yeah, yeah those are the people we fought in fought here. On the way back up uh, we, when we came back up through the ladder. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he won't shit. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know that mage kind of pasted us. <laughs> Smigmal Face Fist. Yeah, there uh, there looks like there's something in the corner here too. If you take a look around the room, mouse around the room. Yeah, oh, beside that bust. There's a magnificent longsword here on the ground. 
in this uh, pouch right there. That's and then I'm very irresponsible for someone to leave that just lying there. You search the room and find a hidden compartment nice. in the floor containing a magnificent cloak, ten finely made arrows, and two potions. Nice. All right, let me pass those to the appropriate individuals. So in this one, that's going to be Baurig. Let's see. Right, you have to you have to check some notes. Oh, check they have notes. They probably went to Thomas actually. Oh yeah, you're right. Oops, I keep forgetting. Okay, yep, the arrows are identified, and those go to who's using the bow? Uh, that should be Curran. I mean, okay. I, can. I, I uh, use a bow. Peter now has a bow. Oh, no, no, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, Peter has the bow. Peter has okay. the bow. Okay, and the cloak is identified. It's a cloak of elf kind, and then there's oh, a nice. potion of speed. I'm dropping that to Hugh. Uh, so we have one cloak of elf kind. Who else can use that? Who else wants it? Not I. I think. Uh... Okay. I've got a cloak of protection, so it's not going to do me any good. I've got a cloak of elven kind. Oh, wow. That's okay. a sale. Yeah. That's a sale. Yep. Looks like we're going to have to sell that. Woo! That would uh, probably fetch a little pretty penny, I'd say. Yeah. I'm it's, betting it will um, do. No, they don't, fetch, they don't fetch very pretty penny at all. Uh, it's a quite ugly scraped up penny from the bottom yeah. of a fountain <laughs> tossed in 20 Order. years previous let's see hold on uh, uh, that makes I think that magnificent longsword is still here yep Ooh. well yeah we need a long rest uh, yeah what is that is it identified I don't think so here I'll hand it to you Let's see what that bad boy is. Oh, there's some more stuff we had. It's at. doing the thing where it won't show me <laughs> the tag, so I sent it to you. Oh, found something here in this bed. Uh. Oh, longsword plus one. Nice. Plus one. There's a bed over here. I just tried to unlock this lock, and it wouldn't unlock for me. Oh, nice. Oh, it's because it was like There's a me. door over here. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, I gotta get rid of this studded leather plus one. Yeah, I'm getting rid of that spell. Where's the lock? 100%. It's over to the. It's Not over. There. Yeah, yep. Boy, we were playing. Baldur's Gate the other night, and now I'm trying to move the camera around and shit. I'm like, wait, what? What button does? Yeah, what? Yeah, uh, totally, totally different controls. Stuck in the lock. Okay, uh, left. It's the uh, right click that spins the camera, and the uh, left mouse button. To... Yeah, but you know, like I, yeah, none I mean, of that's conscious. That's all it. subconscious. I just start doing it, and I'm like, uh, wait, what? what? <laughs> Taking me a minute to get acclimated here. Oh, you got there it. Oh, nice. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. Boom. Here we go. It's all shit to sell, and I can't carry it, so have that. Okay. <laughs> I'm already <laughs> encumbered. <laughs> Let me check my weight. Mm, I'm close. I think I got it. I all should right. have enough. Okay. Yeah, yep. I think I'm just over. I got it. I'm just over. Boy, yeah, we are going to have to go to town. Okay, do you want a long rest here, or do you want to go to town? Oh, uh, let's long rest here. Might as well long rest. We're right in front of it. Yeah. Okay. Man, I'm only down one spell. <laughs> oh, no, I'm only down. Well, I'm down two. Oh, wait. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm out of battle focuses. Let's rest. Yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> right, 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 right. Oh, sure, sure. Spells aren't enough That's to make you rest. That's the ranger. The battle the focus ranger feature. always has yeah. spells. Sure, I'm tired. Yeah. yeah. Man, <laughs> all that focusing. <laughs> oh, crap. That's right. Only host can start I the long race. I know we can't see, oh, but I yeah, bet the right. phone's setting about right now. <laughs> In case you guys haven't guessed, we play multiple games together. <laughs> this is why sometimes yeah, we... we seem confused. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we just started. Uh, we just started actually doing a lot more. All right. And now... Okay. Uh, I'm taking some days off this upcoming week, and we're going to play that new Solasta stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of which, 
much. What do we have down there? Oh, nothing important. Okay, so there I think. And yeah. Let's do that. Yeah. All right. I think that would be a much better. Uh, I have down here. Okay. All right. Yep. Oh, Let's okay. do this. Yeah. Time to hit up Scrang. Because we have those two temples on the second floor we haven't purified yet. Yeah. Now there's a door over here. Oh. I purified them before I left. <laughs> oh, wait. No. It's opposite of purified. Desecrate. Modules are completely broken just due to those types of changes. When we get the ruins of Iltismar, you'll see some of those too. They remove some assets, and I had to seriously cover my butt and come up with a completely way of doing things because on occasion they'll just randomly remove an asset from the tool set, and so everything that you used it in will just magically and mystically disappear. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, well... Oh, yeah, that's right. We got to stop into Otis and sell some stuff. Oh, plus two shield. Oh, yes. that's We've right. got new merchants yeah. available. Adamantium. New merchant available. Yep. Oh, Adamantium cool. plate. Yep. Really Dwarven right. plate. It did what? say something about that. Once you oh, get to the shit. third floor, the merchants upgrade. So now we can actually buy... Higher crossbow plus armor. two. Heavy crossbow plus two. Longbow plus two. Orvin plate. Scale armor of robustness. Breastplate of they deflection. Got yeah, you know what? I don't know which one you want here, but uh Does can anybody either... need this sword plus one? No, no, or you gotta sell, sell it. Short bow of sharpshooting. Long bow. Oh, there's plus another plus shooting. two shield in here. Right there for that sword. Yeah, there's a warden blade plus one. Oh, warden blades the shit. And a rapier plus two. And a heavy crossbow plus two. And a light crossbow plus two. A longbow plus two. Plate plus and one, Balrog. A mall plus that? two. Uh... uh so your set which, your AC um, to which 19. Which are you at, John? Sammy. Sammy the, Sammy the Smith Apprentice. Player, Sammy. Okay. Smith. Tell you what, Balreg, you pick which, which heavy armor you want, whether it's the adamantine plate that prevents crits or the dwarven plate mail. Your choice. I'll take the other one. Dwarven plate. That's badass, too. AC 20. Holy Are you kidding me? Dude's gonna give us yeah twenty eight. I'm, I'm the dwarf. Gold for studded yeah. leather plus one. Yep. Let's. Oh, baby. Okay, so you wanted the dwarven plate. <sighs> All right. I took a chunk of. I will off. take the. Uh... And then while I get to sell this, uh, you probably want to sell them at the really? other merchant. You sell it to the other merchant because I just tried to sell studded leather armor plus one to that dude, and he was going to give me twenty eight. And the guy next to him is going to give yeah, me three hundred and eighty four. So yeah, yeah, don't sell to that dude. Buy from him. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, that's all I want to sell. Look at this beautiful, beautiful wizard. <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen. Jose, repeat it, that. Repeat that. So Look at this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful what? Look. Wait, come out here in the beautiful. <laughs> come out here in the light. Where we can see you. Right. Hey, Hugh, what are you wanting to buy in here, man? Look at that. That's a fucking dwarven wizard. Did you get the plus two shield? Yeah, there's a plus two uh, shield No, I've in got there. the plus one shield right now. There's a the plus, guy. One, plus two shield available for sale in there. 
Yeah. Yeah, but what's that cost? An- another <laughs> five thousand. What's your AC? Another five thousand. Yeah. What's I your AC? Right now it's twenty four. I do. So that would give you a twenty four. So that would give you a twenty five, and with shield you'd be a thirty. That's ridiculous. 30. Yes. I do, AC. Mention, I do remember you guys asking me about that, about uh, if we'd ever be able to buy higher level items. And uh, I do oh, remember yeah, telling you about my old that. armor was 1320. All right, so there's a nice chunk back in there. Remember, I did say to save the money because it would make a difference later. Yeah, like oh, I want to. Where yeah. you blow it all? <laughs> like I want to. Like I want to buy that longbow for 52. I've found great stuff. I mean, I've got a plus two rapier and a short sword of fairy fire. All right. So is that? Yeah, you're stacked. All right. I'm I mean, I, I could I I'll buy your. Uh... I could use two rapiers. I could buy the other plus two rapier just to, if I've already have somebody highlighted, switch to two rapiers. But I would probably like uh, the short sword of fairy fire, where it's at. I would probably just use that. If anything. I have a plus one mace and a hammer, just in case we run into skeletons. I could switch to some bludgeoning weapons. Like maybe for eighteen thirty, I'd buy that mace of smashing, just so I'd have two. That's my Blunt secondary, stick. you know, yeah, weapon set. Have he doesn't? All right, I gotta talk to the other guy. I need arrows. Look at that armor on you guys. That looks so freaking cool. <laughs> I've not seen the graphics on this plate before, and it is awesome. Yeah, I would really. And like yeah, it. that adamantite plate just shines. It shines. Perfect paladin armor. Yeah. Oh, Bear's Claw is a D6 bludgeoning, a D8 piercing, and it's a morning star. That I really nice. like because it's always like, wait, yeah, what? A morning star does piercing? Like it's a spiked mace. It's that's absolutely. <laughs> it should do bludgeoning and piercing. And piercing, yeah. Uh, you're overloaded there, Balric. I know. I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> I like that. But oh, well, it must be not. the discrepancy in the weight of the two armors. Yep. Are we out of money? <laughs> we had like 17,000. What just happened? Uh, Sammy the Smith. I'm, I'm selling the oh, bracers. Oh, wait, wait. Not to this dude. Oh, not to no, this dude. dude. Yeah. Not today. Uh, yeah, I can sell some, uh, I can sell some scrolls. And stuff. I'm selling the bracers of defense because they're uh, only for somebody unarmored or not using a shield. And that is not this party. Yeah, that is not this wizard. No, not this party. Yeah. Dude, so here again. The other guy to the left was going to give me 48. This dude is giving me 1,200 for the braces. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Uh, so we're going to sell him the short sword plus one. <laughs> nope. Yeah, I set that up for people who are unweary and uh, didn't look. It's a trap. It's a trap. It pays to pay attention. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yep. Oh, I picked up a scroll of stinking cloud. I'm gonna send that to uh Barek here in a sec. Can we read that one? Okay. Start no. using some of these uh I am actually. Let me see if there's any spells that I can memorize real quick. We've got a primed rapier. Uh let me see something. You know, crafting. Um, you can sell that to Chan, and we can go buy it later if we happen to find a recipe for it. I was supposed to say, like, we don't know a ton of weapon recipes. I doubt we're going to create anything better than we're going to find at this point, so I'm going to sell it. I wouldn't say that if I were you, but... Okay, cool. <laughs> oh, are we going back to that other place? Yeah, we're, we're going back to that other place, aren't you? Yeah. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to scribe spells there so we can run into some more mobs. Okay. Hell yeah. We're, so. uh, it just depends on what you guys find. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can't guarantee. You can't promise anything, but, you know. Scrangs. Yep. 
to Mother Scrang. <laughs> That's killer. Back we go. Uh, there's a lot of elements to this module a lot of people don't know about. Because they uh, didn't really... Uh, well, they don't necessarily go the exploring. They get all involved in the dungeon and then they may or may not come back to yeah, town. I oh, by the way, uh, remember where I said there was a bug? Check out that servant of House Celine over to the right. She's the one that's got it. She's got the variable. She's got the what? Excuse me, sir. Might I have Excuse a word me. with you? Yes. <laughs> yes, what is it you need of me? This is regarding the Countess Tilahi of House Selene and her consort, Sir Juffer. Oh, I think we consort. rescued those two in the temple. <laughs> That's the money, right? That's where it should go. Right? Yep. Yes, the same. I am a servant of House Selene. The lady ordered me to give you this package as a token of their esteem. Nothing dangerous, right? Well, for your enemies it may be. But you will find them quite useful for your task. Here you go. I take my leave of you. Again, Countess Talahi and Sir Jaffer express their eternal gratitude. Good day to you. Okay. I am tossing awesome. bower eggs. And, oh, I don't need to. Did you see what? Signets. Oh, Tell the Countess I got a package for her. her. <laughs> a really big one. Empress chain garb, excuse me, Empress garb chain shirt, which I'm going to hand to Hugh because I think he's going to want that. And we each got a signet of House Selene ring. Oh, that's freaking dope. See invisible creatures and objects. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, hell yeah, Hugh. That's a badass chain shirt for you. I suddenly Clothing. feel very close Clothing. to invincible. Yeah, check it out, oh, Hugh. I no dropped it on you. Oh, plus now, two. There he is. Look at that armor. Yep. Dude, that's now, plus you, you. two AC to what I'm wearing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's a 13 to a 15. Now, in the original module, she drops a suit of, I think, plus one plus, or plus five. three elven so chain. Look at you, 23. 23. With two weapons. AC 23. Mm -hmm. Man. This is a bad party. Yeah, I'll be staying uh, in the back with an AC 16. <laughs> <laughs> now, in the original Temple of Elemental Evil, the pen and paper module, she gives you uh, a suit of, I believe, uh, magical elven chainmail, which is what that is, which in first edition was actually... You know, in, in later editions, it was called Mithril Chain Mail, yeah. or Mithril yeah. Chain Shirt. But in first edition, they did actually have these, and I think it was like a plus one or plus two, and there was almost no weight on it. So this is probably a little bit different, but in Celasta, this is the closest thing to Elven Chain Mail or an Elven Chain Shirt. Sure. Yeah, let's go talk to Skrank. Uh, that's right, Ruda. Got about Haruda. Are you guys talking to Haruda? Uh, yeah, currently. Uh, uh, I'm shopping. Yeah, let me know when you're done so I don't interrupt you. I don't want to. Uh, jump in just in case. That I don't think it kicks me out. Yeah, you can shop at the same time, but I think like dial. Well. All right. No, I was talking about the dialogue. Yeah, I'm still yeah. shopping. Yeah, because we'll have to. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, no, that's no biggie. I was just going to wait. I was going to be in. Oh, can you not dialogue while I'm in there? It'll kick you oh. out. Yeah, okay. Oh, that, yeah, that's the problem. That's what I was waiting on. Okay, who wants to do string and who wants to do uh, Ruta? We found something odd in the dungeons below the temple. 
It's some kind of artifact, a golden skull amulet. Have you ever heard of something like this? There's a string. Okay. Oh, that's right. Yeah. He does a really good right. job with it. Did you say a golden skull amulet? Let me take a look at that. Looks over the amulet briefly. Could this be the key we've heard rumors of? The one the former followers of Mariaki claim were found during the original Temple of Mariaki construction? The documents from the time of the old Mariaki Temple do talk about a strange skull amulet that was found in an area being constructed for the temple. I wonder if this item is one and the same. We also did find a journal with references to it being some kind of key to a special portion of the temple. You'd best hold on to this amulet, then. It appears it's incomplete. There are four slots here for something to be inserted into. It is obviously important. I will continue to research this while you continue your explorations. Fair enough. We will get back to the temple. Damn. Okay, let's talk to her again. All right. We have found the elemental temple of fire. Oh. <laughs> it was on the second floor of the dungeon. You described the temple in detail to you. I see, I see. This one will be fairly easy to purify. For that, you just need holy water. But it is not going to be easy as it looks. Do you remember those tiny figures that danced in the fires? Those were likely the guardians of the fire temple, and they are what powers the evil rituals therein. You pour the holy water into the fire pit, they will likely rise to stop you. I'll try. Here is the holy water, hands you a vial. Just be careful and expect trouble the minute you pour it in. Okay. Huh? Will do. We will attempt to purify the fire temple. We've managed to find the air temple on the second floor of the dungeons as well. You asked us to let you know when we found it. Oh, this is excellent news. Tell me in detail what this temple looks like. I must know every detail. You describe in detail what the interior of the air temple looks like. I suspect it as much. For this one, take this. Hand you some incense. This is holy incense from Einar. Drop this in the burning braziers on the altar of the air temple. Wary, though said you did not see any guardians when you entered. Once you burn the incense, they will likely come out to protect the temple. We will be cautious. All we need to do is just burn this incense in the braziers on the altar to purify it. If you need anything more, talk to Hruda. She'll sell you whatever you need. Light them up, 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 light them up, up, up. <laughs> Hell yeah. Dude, AC 23 for a dual, no shield ranger. That's badass. Yeah, that's Dude, right? Not too bad. Yeah. That is badass. I'm feeling good. Found a lot of the secret doors, but you haven't found all of them. So. You know, that's one thing in 5th edition that, like, perception is a wisdom check. And I feel like, yeah, you know, it used to be you wanted an intelligent rogue because it gave you skill points and investigation or, you know, okay. spot checks. Yeah. Well, I was going to say, uh, to be honest with you, I actually do think that perception should be an intelligence check. But, you know, wisdom... It, or you should be able to apply wisdom. investigation... Yeah, maybe maybe wisdom is maybe perception is wisdom, but you should be able to apply investigation or they like that. So I, I, uh, I actually I agree. Oh 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 I need to sell. Are we going oh. back yeah, I'm encumbered. Uh, I need so to sell my 
I agree with you about that. The Dungeon Master's Guide actually gives, or no, it's the maybe it's the Player's Handbook actually gives uh, gives liberty that you can An alternate rule. You can, whether yeah. it's perception, investigation, whether uh, no, what, survival, no, what it, whatever, what, you, no, what ability score it's based on. So they have like they have them categorized. Like they say that perception is a wisdom under the wisdom score, but they give you the freedom to say. Okay, if your player wants, you, you can allow your player to use a different ability score if that's okay. how, right? Like you can, you can do that. Like okay. instead of making an athletics check, a strength check, you could make an athletics check, a dexterity check. Okay. Or, okay. And vice okay. versa. Well, that's fit. Yeah. That fit. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Because oh, I agree totally. I do think passive perception is a wisdom check because it's passive. Right, that has nothing it's to do. Innate. You don't have yeah. to think about it. It's a, yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. That's genetics. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so I sold my armor. Got twelve twenty nine. We do have over five thousand now. If there's anything else we wanted, I don't think. You know, again, all of these would be secondary weapons for me. Well, I mean, like I could buy a plus two cross heavy crossbow. Uh, Dude, if you're gonna use it, fifty. Fucking get it. Uh, only thing that I would get would be the plus two shield. I'd rarely. Oh, we have 5,000. You need the plus two shield. Get it. I'm stepping away. Come get it. Remember to sell the other one to Chon. I can sell my plus one shield. Yeah. Yep. Sell your plus one. Yeah, exactly. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Oh, that was close. You're going to be a I'm 20. Five, a wizard with a 25 Chon. armor class. Peter, I'm look selling to Thomas, right? and yes, look some. You're head selling to, to John and how do you wrap seven. yourself in metal like that? <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Twenty-seven armor class. I know tomorrow the DLC gets to work. Gets to, but they need to God. immediately get to work on raising the level cap to twenty. <laughs> yeah. So you can get yeah. play that wizard and get Tensor's Transformer and become a fighter. Yeah, that'd be really interesting because that one, that specific wizard, can gain a just enormous levels of armor class. That's specific I'll take, specialization. I'll take multi class while we're at it because then you <laughs> could go two levels of cleric and become a battle cleric and put a sword in your hand. Oh, yeah, that that's true. Hey, you could, depending on what uh, race you play. I feel so good, I'm just going to jump over the wall. I was going to say, dude, I'm, <laughs> I'm zooming in so we can take a good look at everybody's... Uh, hold on, I'm going to close this a minute. I just want to show everybody this. Turn turn around, Hugh. Uh, <laughs> I'm kidding. With Sashay over here? Yeah, there you go, right there. There you go. So look at this Look at this new... These guys set up armor. That's badass. Man, the party looks pretty cool. Dude, yeah, like, don't even try to hide you guys, because if it, you know, your skill might be high, except for Curran, but your skill might be high, but damn, Silver, you're going to shine. You're just going to shine. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> right, right. All right. That's why Here I requested go. mine be finished in a matte, as opposed to glossy. <laughs> Are the feats are the huge ones. Yeah, I'm still more feats. I think can't, yeah. can't, can't yeah. tell you about more, it, but the feats what, are really 27 more feats, was it? Mm hmm. Yep. Uh, in three hours and four minutes, you can tell us about it. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, All right. It'll be tomorrow. Uh, dungeon Wait. level. Don't go in yet. Air temple. Look. Don't go in yet. She said, don't go yet. Hold. Don't go in yet. Okay. Hold. Closing. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, he's scribing scrolls. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, Got dude. It. Blur. Nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, you, that's it. He's impossible to hit now. 25 AC, and you have disadvantage, and I'll do blur and mirror image. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is going to be ridiculous. And then spell shield for a bonus. How many freaking hit points? <laughs> oh, 50? Shit. Uh, 40? <laughs> yeah. We got you got more. Oh, here's a scroll of stinking yeah, cloud. Uh, uh, uh oh, crap! I probably shouldn't. Are we have done too that. far apart? 
I didn't realize you did that. Can you, can you get it back on a short rest, or do you need a long rest? Because we're at the campfire. I need a long rest for that. All right, we'll do it at the campfire. Okay. When he gets done scribing his scrolls. He cast the I'm at the campfire still. Yeah, yeah, well, if you're scribing scrolls, it's like I casted uh, Shield of Faith. Yeah, so when you're but, done uh, scribing. You're scribing scrolls, oh, gotcha, so. gotcha. Then we'll, we'll long rest again. I'll get the spell back. Yeah. All right, here's Stinking Cloud. Well, shit. <laughs> <laughs> stinking cloud. Shit. We'll it. it all uh, works. Well, stinking it works. cloud. I don't <laughs> want it. Take it. I don't want stink clouds. I'm not into that. Oh, that's a bummer. <laughs> yeah, I, I I knew I I kind of um oh, wow. Shifted that one around a little bit cuz I wanted to succeed on it. I knew that was going to be the one that I was going to Creature can Damn see God. invisible, so that's passive. We don't need to activate that or anything. We can just see invisibility. Mm -hmm. yep. Put it on the ring and you can see invisible objects. Nice. I Might think it's very in interesting. Hand. It reads uh, objects and creatures, right? Yep. And you notice, like, all of us yeah. got one at once. That means we need this. There's something, yep. there's some shit coming up. Really all right. Might. right, Jose, I'm going to tell you what I've always wanted to do with that spell, and I've never been able to get it right, and you're the master of these types of spells. The levitate? Yep. Levitate an enemy, like as you, high you as you can. make somebody else an enemy high? And then drop no. Yep. No. Then cancel your concentration drop. and drop them. It's D6 per 10 feet. Yep. For fall. So if you can get them up 30 feet and cancel it and they fall, 3D6. Yep. We will give it a try. I always manage to really fuck that up somehow. As simple as it sounds. Like, I understand in my mind how it's to work. Yep. But I always fuck it up. <laughs> yep. I, uh, well, there was this alternate rule in, uh, I remember in first edition, where it was like, you could run it nice. as like, one die six, and then, then, uh, for 20 feet, it was going to be uh, th uh, another a two die six, and then 30 feet, you know, um, three die six. But it, but it, there was an alternate rule for fall damage in first edition, where nice. if if you fell 30 feet, you'd do one die for the first 10, and then two die for the next 10, and then three die for the next 10. So it was like one die plus two die plus three die, so six die six for a 30 foot fall. Oh yeah. Oh, by the way, you got more out of all. I need to drop. No, but I need to drop two more pounds. Hmm. I don't have two more pounds to drop. <laughs> yeah, That's maybe gonna have to. Should have taken that strength plus two. With you know, with that build, that's not a bad idea. Um, no, not at all. Because that's definitely where I'm um, coming up short. Oh. Oh, this uh, oh, we are oh, eighth. The dwarf was coming up short. Uh, did he, <laughs> we, uh, we are eighth. Let's see. If we go to twelfth, you'll get another feed. All right, I'm gonna hit this camp. Uh, well, you, oh, you know. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Karin, you can take those potions, and then. Oh, I'm so close. I've got point fucking one to drop. Oh, oh, the Inquisitor's from... Got an albino yeah. minotaur head. Oh, that's right. We said I couldn't put it down. Yeah, you I got, got that on your belt. That's on your belt, hanging from your belt. That's your trophy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. My oh, cod, right. cod nine. piece. Uh, I am, like, on right. the edge of 122.9 of 126. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, All right here we're we go. good to go. All right. Wait, do we? No, 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 no. Let's go the long way so we can trigger the um, random encounter. Did you want to change your spells at oh, all, right? Okay, yes, yeah, that's fine. Yes, yes, I do. Man, I've got so many choices. I thought so. Y'all shut the fuck up. You're talking too much tonight. The hell is going on? <laughs> Jesus Christ. You think people yeah, want to look quiet. at this shit? It's all quiet. Come on. Wow. Well, when I think about it, it's like 
I mean, maybe not for you guys, but like me and you have been literally gaming all week because he had a, he had that week off, so he asked me to like come I can right. game with him, <laughs> and uh, and I did, and uh, we got uh, we ended up just doing it like every night. And to be honest with you, see, you know, Greg always cuts out early on these, but. No, me and you will be going to like two in the morning. <laughs> it's because Greg's Maybe a smart motherfucker. You never know. <laughs> five, at one, we had, we did end up going to about three thirty in the morning one time. I think it was five my time. <laughs> yeah, I was there, yeah. yeah. Right, right, right. And uh, so you know, we were like me and me and you have been pretty much gaming solid all last week. And uh, so I know you guys were like, <laughs> we finally got to this point where we're like. Oh man, that's right! Another game session, and we spent last night. We all spent last night playing poker, right? So uh, yeah, that was great. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Hey, all right. So, we... children at home, public service announcement: When you grow up, you won't like playing games all week long. <laughs> <laughs> It'll wear down on you. <laughs> all right, are we going in this door. Wait, what? You, I'm not going to like playing door. games. Are we, are we going in that door? <laughs> yeah, we're going in the door. We're going to the air temple. All right, going in the door. Yep, going to the well, air temple. Well, then I don't want to grow up. Morning. <laughs> sure enough not, dude. No, you should have got up and drank a beer in the morning. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> dude, my I got dropped off. My hand was shaking that day. I was like this. I drank. Oh, I drank too much. You didn't much. drink enough on the way there. Oh, that, yeah. Yeah, I drank too much the night before. Is keep what it going. To me. Just keep it going. Stay up. Oh, keep God. drinking. You got it. You toss holy incense into the braziers. Thick smoke starts pouring out of the brazier. When the smoke clears, an unholy monstrosity of rot and decay held together by fungus is standing behind you. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, you now popped up in front of us. Didn't we talk about how we would have complete control of when we entered combat and we could buff up? <laughs> yeah, I did. I had I had utter control. Dude, okay. This, this thing, I'm going to give it within my power. Okay. I give it Summon three rounds. Right now. I give it three rounds. All right. I think uh, three let's... rounds is dead. You're very optimistic. I am. I don't think you've got that long. Watch, watch this. Oh, ouch. Nice. Yep. Yep. That's battle. Starting to highlighted? Try. Yeah. He's yep. highlighted. Yep. He gets two more of those, I think. No, not this turn. Oh, okay. Uh, it was an action to drink the potion in this game. Nope. Oh, okay. Which gotcha. is interesting. No. Uh, you know, it was. I told Silverquick about the your little house rule: the three bonus, the bonus, three potions on your belt, a bonus action to use. Yep. And it's yep. interesting in Baldur's Gate, it's a bonus action to use potions. Like I think that's much more fitting. Of course, in Baldur's Gate, it's a bonus action to hide. That yeah, is. But there's very effective uses of your bonus action, whereas some builds without that don't have. Ah, uh, 24 miss. Miss on a 24. Oh, what? Oh, he had to roll a 20. <laughs> he had to roll pretty high for that. Oh, that that. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, wow. Oh, got the dude. most hit yeah. points in the party 92. <laughs> Oh, I'm getting the measure of this. Boy, they love to do that to me, don't they? Oh yeah, totally. A one and a two on an Fuck advantage it. roll. Jose, you could literally go stand beside that thing and have like a two percent yeah, chance I don't think of ever being hit. About. Yeah, that's insane for like a wizard. To... That is insane. Frontline wizard. Yeah. Yeah, it is. That's badass. It's not, uh... It'd be great if they had some kind of like, uh, for this type of a build, it'd be great if they had some kind of like spiked gauntlet so that you still had your free hand, but you had like a little at least something when you hit barehanded. Right. You know? Mm -hmm. Give you, give you, like, you know, I don't know, a D4 piercing. No, no, it needs to just ignore somatic components, like, uh, uh, the same with this dual wield ranger needs to be able to ignore somatic components, the same as the battle cleric. And who else can I have do a it? Feeling that, uh, I, 
A spell sword. Validate my spells. Yep. When spell I... sword can do that too. Spell oh. sword ignores thematic components. You know, Davor, he he scribed his holy symbol on his shield, and I carry a oh. weapon and a shield, and I can ah, cast all my spells. No problem with. But you're a battle cleric. No yeah. Given. That's what a battle cleric can ignore. See, if you uh, can multi-class, that really would be the most popular like dip. Damage. Because with two spells, you now ignore... With two levels, you go battle cleric, and you now ignore somatic components. Oh, I see what you mean. To anything you cast. Yeah. So you go wizard, now you don't have to worry and about it, it anymore. Or anything. Right. You yeah. ignore somatic components. Weapon and shield. Yeah. Uh, if you're a fighter, it takes three levels to get Nice! Out, you know? Right, I said what three? I said I gave it three rounds, and this is round two. From 150 to 50. Hell Got yeah, a lot of hit to plug. 38. Yeah, but it's fucked. I mean, <laughs> now he's still going. Eh. Again, harder. Eh, good. Well, we're about 8th level. Oh yeah, hell yeah. I imagine if I was doing this by myself, like a lot of people are, I would probably be running back and forth between temples. Whereas we kept going and cleared everything and then went back to the temples, so we have like that. Yeah. Yeah, it, uh, I mean, when I when I did the play testing for this, I uh, I did it. I I actually ended up clearing out all the temples first, and then I came back. That's our air temple, so the next place Not we would need to go would be the fire Evo temple, unless. <laughs> Hell yeah! And then just cures himself. Kieran. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see who's Kieran. Oh, that's right. Uh, I'm down four hit points. Yeah, that'd be fine. You know, some of them really are, because... No, and it depends on a lot of this, and oh, this is a... true in the original module, too. Oh, a... oh, that's right. There's one right over here. <laughs> Holy shit. It's like right... Oh. Yeah, right here. Oh, it's right next to us. Yep, hit that thing. Okay, here we go. I totally did that encounter wrong. On the first turn... I drank a potion of speed and then battle focused. And on the second turn, I had more attacks and I didn't battle focus. If I'd have done it then, I'd have killed that oh, thing. Yep, you might have. Yeah. Okay, do you want me to dump in the holy water? Hold on, let me evaluate my options for where I'm going to go real quick. Okay. I think over here was... Yeah, there we go. Yeah, give us a minute to prepare. Uh, uh, anybody need to do anything? Um, Hang on. Oh, I better change weapons. Yeah. Besides, I'm glitching here. Hold on. Let's see if I'm uh, one minute. Okay, that only lasts a minute. All right. So let me know when you're about to do it. <laughs> okay. All right. Let me take a quick look here, and I'm gonna shield up. Pakri. You no, know, nah, I'm not doing this. I don't think poison's gonna have any effect against elementals. That's what we're fighting. Okay, are we ready? Yep. Uh, am I hidden? Then yes, we are ready. You dump holy water in the sacrificial fire pit. Suddenly, small figures in the fire grow to become fire ospreys as the mystic flame slowly burns out. Ooh, and an unholy monstrosity. My side. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Oh. Damn it. I should have done pass without trace. Now 
Now, in the real Temple of Elemental Evil module, these are oh, actually oh, salamanders. No Fire salamanders. Fire salamanders? Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. And you uh, see how that Osprey crit hit on uh, Thomas yep. for nothing? nothing. <laughs> And this is a good use of the fire resistance ring. In fact, you'll make a lot of use out of it. Yeah. All right. Got to be like that, does it? Okay. You're gonna regret that. I have a. I have a plan. Me too. I'm gonna try yeah. to. I'm gonna try to cut the big guy off. With a wall of something. Oh yeah, that's right. You have that. You have a couple of options. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna just try to separate him from them. I'll take the hits for a couple rounds. It's fine. I'll go wolf on his ass. He'll hate that shit. <laughs> I don't think you can cast in wolf form. Oh no no no! I'm talking after I quit cast. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Smack nice. the shit out of. Oh, nice they got spot. some hit points too. Okay. All right. That's all right. It's still okay. About 17, 15. It's like about 60 or 70 hit points. Oh, that hit. Yes. Wow. Thank you. A three hit. Wow. Oh. Wow. Nice. That's a. That's nice. badass. Nice. All right. See if I can finish this guy off. Ah, oh, shield of faith. Boo. That's battle. Damn. Oh, really? One hit point. <laughs> well, it uh, looks like it's probably maybe got three or four. <laughs> Used to. Used to. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. Okay, let's see if I can hold this guy up and keep him off of you. Ah! Alright, you fucks. Ah, uh, man, that's a shame. This is the better encounter for the potion of speed. Right. More attack, more objects to attack. You get to use more, do more damage. Maybe these fire ospreys would have taken poison damage too. That would have been sweet. <laughs> Alright, I gotta remember to build up to that. Some poison damage, battle focus. What's the Potion of speed. Deal? Natura, Conjo, Clipe. Nice. Bond of Wall of Thorns, okay? Yep. Yeah, you don't want to be that, that close to a wall of fire. Steve, this looks cool. <laughs> oh, thanks, man. This thanks. looks this looks cool. Arcana, Conjo, very bad. New contenders, new contenders, fire jesters. 
Yeah. Those are friendly. Yep. Are they? Oh, they're yeah, summoned. They're, yeah. They are. Yeah, they're green. They are. God damn it, Jose, you confused me. <laughs> I had to look in the dialogue to be like, he's fucking with me. <laughs> That's awesome. So the thought behind that is they're Lock. all going to be immune to each other. Yep. Yeah, that's yeah. what I said. I, was, I did that so much good walk. Our pits for so each now other. going to attack each other and loop. Yeah. Them. Oh, nice. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Best of luck. <laughs> Unifier. Oh no, the fire jester's on fire from the fire <laughs> Oh <Oscar>. no! <laughs> it heals five. <laughs> oh no! That's awesome. He failed to save. Oh no! Twenty-four. Right. Twenty-four slash. Oh, get him to go back through that thing. To, uh, misty step on the other side of it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do my best. Actually, you could run through the columns. Yep. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, because he's probably gonna take. He's probably gonna attack us next. I'm gonna have to go tank it. <gasps> Got more tricks up my sleeve. Silly rabbit tricks are for kids. <laughs> it's interesting because neither one of those two can hurt each other. Burning. Yeah, that's exactly why I summoned. Mm -hmm. Burning that's, that's, down the house. The <laughs> do, 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 do. Burning. Our house. In the middle of a. You might get what you're after. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Come on. Three hundred sixty-five degrees, burning down the house. <laughs> More. I mean, he he did he does deserve more. There you go. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Aura of Righteousness. Yeah. <sighs> hmm. Nice. I hate to do this to you, you, but... Hopefully I can take this guy out the next round. Hmm. Okay, I'm just looking at options here. Follow it. Yeah, alright. I was about to say, who took damage from what, huh? No. Fire damage. Not my party. They start you on fire, then you take the fire damage each round. But I have that ring of fire resistance, which is amazing. Oh, nice hit, crush him. No need to smite. Yeah, nice. beautiful, epic, epic. Great tactics on this one, guys. I totally didn't expect that conjure animal. Are you used to use conjure elementals on that? You gotta fight fire with fire. Yeah. Worked mm -hmm. exactly. 
I don't know about you, Peter, but you might want to back out of there. Your choice, so. Oh, blight. How's it gonna do? Oh, 30. Oh, he took it. Okay, not nasty blight. I was worried he was going to be resistant to that. Oh. You know, I really don't Hell, have a lot resistant of... Hell, he's resistant just about everything else, but... <laughs> I don't really Blight's have a, a lot great... of places to go, man. You know what I'm Blight's saying? Blight's a great fucking spell. With my sorcerer, I would twin spell it and cast oh, it on God. two things. Like, if I move, he gets an That'd opportunity to attack, so... He does. Yep, I'm just going to... I've got a block. Yeah, I'm just going to hang true. right here. Oh, a 20! <laughs> That's hysterical. Hell yeah, man. Bring it, unholy monstrosity. <laughs> I am Peter, and these are my metal clad disciples. <laughs> <laughs> Peter Puffer. <laughs> Thorny <laughs> Peter, the wolf. <laughs> oh, that is actually pretty cool looking. And I am hungry like the wolf. Hungry. <laughs> Let's see if he's a bit. I feel like he's going to be. Conjo Malvis. Oh yeah, uh -huh. I just remembered okay. something. He made his save. It didn't say he was immune, so that's cool. He made his save. Nope. It didn't, but he may not, uh, he didn't take damage, so it wouldn't have told us. Right. Jose, that summon elemental was a stroke of absolute fucking genius. Yeah, because if, if you Thank hadn't you, done sir. that, uh, they, they, they would go and sit, like, across from all of us, and then they do this fire attack, which is an AoE fire attack around oh. us. And they haven't done that because your elemental stopped them. Oh, let's Cause, block that. Because he put them to sleep without putting them to sleep. Yeah, really, that's what happened. Right. Now they're occupied. Nice. They do this fire burst attack, and it's a lot of damage. Because you did that, they can't do it. Nice. He got me. Oh no! Oh, he, oh, he did. Oh no no! Oh, what's that? No, he was coming after me. Oh, that was cute. Try again. Oh, that's oh, badass! Wow. wow. Twenty-five miss. Oh. Yeah, that's insane. And then, yep, it's gonna attack. It's like, like actually, that Sorry, wasn't even current, close. Yes, 30, 80, 80. Like, actually, that wasn't even close. You got a twenty-five. Yeah, no, dude. I just want to express this in mechanical terms. Jose used a summoning spell for control. Yep, he did. That's exactly what he did. That's ex right. it's he badass. The right thing at the right time. That's badass, dude. Yeah. That's. Fucking dope. This is one that I kind of stumbled on by mistake because from the very first time I played mm. the main campaign solo, I had an encounter with the uh, elementals and I meant to summon a different type of elemental, but it summoned fire. Wait, mistake, what? And I was so pissed. Come on. Because I summoned uh, fire on fire. But, uh, no, no, and then they no, just no. sat there and attacked each other and did no damage the whole time. And I was like, okay, yeah. okay, I know what to do now. Yeah. No, Jose, listen, fuck you. I, I try to hurt a fire creature with fire, and no. <laughs> it's not happening. You, yeah, you, yeah, that's bullshit. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, of course, because totally opposite, apples and pears, but that was cool. That's, that's cool. This is... Appreciate it. Yeah, I dig it. That's just out of the box, that's cool. All right, God. well, I'm going to just extinguish my flame here so I'm not on fire anymore. Not that that's important. And we're just going to end turn. It's just annoying. That's yeah, all. Really? <laughs> that's what it is. Nuisance. Yeah. You get, when you have a fire resistance ring, it just doesn't, isn't going to do much. 
Oh, another one. Yeah. Nice. Another 30. That shoots through. Wow. Take that. I am Peter. Unholy monstrosity slayer. <laughs> well, yeah, I am Peter. <laughs> Unholy monstrosity beater. Yeah. <laughs> Unholy monstrosity Peter. Now you, quickly, get it to one hit point. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Let's see. I think I've seen. Yeah, that was just. This has been handled tactically perfect. This is really good. Good job, guys. It's uh, normally what happens is those four, uh, four fire ospreys, they'll line up along your party and they just do this constant fire burst. So you can take a lot of damage on this one, but you didn't. All because of those fire ospreys, fire gestures. Yeah, that, yeah, it's just freaking. Oh, it was, it was keep. He was probably going to take some this round, though. No. Take some, take some life from others. <laughs> yeah. Here's what we're going to do. Yeah. Is his battle master still applied? Is uh, battle focus? Arcana. Yeah, is uh, only for that turn. Evil. Oh. Oh my <laughs> God, dude! Nasty. <laughs> he's the one of yeah. He's he's been doing that. He'll like jack all of his charges up. That, that wand of magic castle. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know it's got seven charges, but I consider it a one-use. Yeah, it's uh, it does just that. Holy shit! Fuck! Awesome, Jose is like, it's got seven charges, but I'm all in. Yeah, <laughs> yeah pretty much. That's right. Every time, Jose quickly <laughs> succumbs to the all-in. Strategy. <laughs> All in strategy. <laughs> right. Oh man. He's like, he's on to this all in something. <laughs> Worked pretty well for you, you. Pretty well. Well, you couldn't tell when I had good cards or when I didn't, because I was always yeah, all in. Like. <laughs> always all in. I mean, look at this poor thing. Osprey rolled a 16 and misses. Uh, yeah. With oh, a yeah. plus six. Yeah, this is uh, not long for uh, not long for battle. This one. Yeah, you guys handled this one perfect. I don't think I I'm. Uh, it's yeah. not worth battle focus or. Really not. Uh, Hunter's right. Mark or anything now. Yeah. Take that. Oh, yeah. Nice hit. Huh. Dude, rocking that 92 hit points is badass, too. Yeah. I mean, I'm at 128 right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm at 114. That's awesome. Oh. Yep. A wizard a with 114 hit points uh, and a 20 uh, hit uh, right uh, now. Or 30 AC. Yeah. That's insane. It is. Now, what you guys didn't see. Dude, you used to be worried about an arrow <laughs> when you were a wizard. Yeah. <laughs> right. That arrow does what? A D6? Shit. Damn. That's both my hit dice. Wow. <laughs> Flawless concentration.
Natura. Evo. Curee. equivalent of two dogs barking at each other on the other side yeah, of the fence. pretty much. <laughs> That's really what it is. It's brilliant. It's just waiting to die. <laughs> waiting to die. That's pretty much going to take him out right there. Yes, sir. Yep, I hope. Nice. Hell yeah, dude. Nice kill. Now, the matter of this guy. Yep. <laughs> yeah, he's fucked. Mm -hmm. You little piss ant. <laughs> Did he take your spot? Yeah, that's where I was planning to go. I think we just walk out of the temple now. <laughs> Pretty much. Just leave the three of them. Yeah, we can go to the third level after this one because now we've cleared them all out. <sighs> now, technically, you can go back to Canon SE Day at this point. And uh, she'll give you another quest for the greater temple below. He gone. Yeah. Uh, she also gives you a, yeah. uh, a plus two half plate, but because of the party and the way it is right now, uh, we're probably not going to need that. Hey, we'll be able to sell it by something else cool. Yeah, pretty much it. Now, one thing most people miss is that as soon as you dump that holy water in there, it drops a frostburn sword on you. Which is the only way oh. you could do it. So you do cold damage now. Bam! <laughs> nice. Okay, so one of the things that... Uh, you get out of that which is normal in the actual the real module too is you get you pick up um a frostburn longsword oh and a ring of fire resistance there's another ring of fire resistance here nice. for anybody that wants it got some uh materials some if you guys want to crafting ring. stuff yep so the two uh, treasures that you get now I don't have this in there because you can't search this I had in order the way that Celasta works I couldn't set this up as a search but normally when you search the fire pit after you uh, or if you search this fire pit you should find a uh, a frost band a frost brand long sword and you should find a ray of fire resistance but you know in this case I had to drop them on the main character right off the bat in the end, or as soon as you pour the water in. So technically you have Thanks a ring of combat. Guys. Yeah. So anyway, I now have an extra ring of uh, fire resistance if anybody wants it. And I picked up that Frostburn Longsword, which is slightly more damage than the uh, than the uh, Firebrand, or the uh, Flame Tongue. And it's a cold damage, not a fire damage. Oh. I will take anything anybody doesn't want. Okay. Not a problem. <laughs> um, I mean, I don't know if you guys want this extra fire resistance ring, but I am uh, currently got it in my inventory if you want it. We've got two rings on. It's an attunement item. It's an yeah, attunement. I got two rings. Yeah. I don't want the, I'll I don't skip want the it fire as... resistance. Yeah, I'll skip okay. the fire resistance as well. All right, I'll hang on to it because, well, I think I'm the only one here who really needs the fire resistance, so.
Yeah, multilingual. He was Arabic. Impressive. Uh, that's what my sister did. He was Arabic and, of course, spoke Spanish from growing up in Puerto Rico and English, so I guess prilingual. Oh, uh, so Amy spoke a little bit of French and Spanish from high school and just had a knack for languages, and uh, when she went in, they assigned her Polish. Because really? uh, you go to language yeah, school in Monterey, and then they assign you a language. They assign you whatever. You show your aptitude for what, to learn a language, and they assign you what they need. And, like, the girl next to her got... Lithuania. In South Korea <laughs> when I was born. So oh. that makes me wonder if maybe he didn't also speak Korean. So Amy went, Amy's husband was a helicopter pilot. And they lived in Korea for a few years and Amy taught English to Koreans. Hmm. Whoa. Like, like out of the, not so affiliated yeah, with English the. English is a second language. I know on base. Like yeah, yeah. Okay, while well, we're on the second floor, we've cleared the second floor. If we look at our map here, we can see we've pretty much cleared pretty much everything. So we, we left off on the third floor. And there is a little uh, trap door here to go down to the third floor. Or we can go way the heck back to one of the exits and go back down to the third floor. How do you want to do it? Uh, let's go down that trap door at the center so there. we take the trap door. Yeah. Oh, okay. Got to put us down into the... Uh... We haven't done any trap doors yet, I don't think, in this temple. Yep. We've always found the long way around. Yep, you sure did. And, uh, it was tough in that one because a lot of the creatures that are actually existing there don't, aren't actually in Celasta, so... Yeah, so you're trying to use other things to represent them. Yep. So I had to do that a lot in that first level. This one, not so much. Hold on a minute. Okay, Hugh is our lead, so you pick Hold on. the direction we go. We've got a hallway left. Well adorned. And gates forward and a secret door to the right. Okay, we are following on you, Hugh. Secret door Side always gets my attention. Uh, uh. Ooh, bracers of sparkles, yeah. area is lined with disquieting guardians or trophies. Nine suits of various armor stand at attention along each war wall. Each holds <laughs> some item of interest in their hand. Weapons of various sorts. Oh, shit. Hope these things don't come alive. We're about to find out. Yeah, there's something to search there. As you examine this suit of armor closer, you notice this shield is of high quality. Plus one shield. There's a bunch of shit. Thomas all right, all right, hold up, hold up, stop. There's a shadow. Nobody moves, stop. Way. Hold still. <laughs> All right, hold it. There's a shadow, two shadows on the other side of this. Yep. Undead immune poison. All right. Um, hold on one sec. Um, don't don't start anything yet. <laughs> I'm gonna use one of these. Okay, we got at least three shadows up here. Yeah, there's three shadows. All right, I'm gonna start exploring. Following behind Hugh. Well, give me room to fall back if I get spotted. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't. It's like four of them. Three shadows here. Four in this room, one in the next. Oh, nice. Didn't get spotted at all. Six. 
Uh, hold on. Six, Shit, eight, ten, twelve. We've got a dozen shadows here. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm going to move closer to the rest of the party. I can block that space off in he front of us. He is literally walking we ever beside them. He is walking in the squares beside them. That is epic. Yeah. Well, a dozen you know shadows up here. Spiritual so, uh, looks like a good choice. Uh, a dozen? Um, I count 13 current. Mm. Shit, well, the shadows. I went to public school. <laughs> I count 12. I think you need to recount. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, you're right. That's just Curran. My bad. <laughs> okay. How do we want? I didn't to say a baker's dozen. <laughs> a baker's dozen. <laughs> I mean, we can definitely. I was trying to allude to the fact that you were um, being as stealthy as a shadow. Yeah, he's uh, he's good. I could put a ring of thorns in the corridor. So stealthy, the I snuck up on shadows. Uh, I have to come through <laughs> And the ones. All right, I'm. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to fuck this guy up. You're gonna stay back Look, on that he side. He don't see me yet. Come back Look. from our side. Yeah, come he on. Don't, see don't me split yet. the party. Come back to this side. Okay. Uh, they, I think they want to use like a wall to try and take them out. Okay, if you want, to, that's fine. If you want, I'll walk right by him. Oh God! And I just don't want. I don't want him on the other side of my spells if I have to cast or want to cast something. Okay. All right. Well, you know what, mages and druid, go ahead and initiate this one. You've got full surprise you on them. Throw so. down your wall. I uh, don't have a wall. But I have spike growth. I mean, uh, poison will do me no good here. Spike growth works. I don't need any toxin. Wait, these are skeletons. So switch to bludgeoning weapons. No, they're shadows. No, no they're shadows. They're, oh, they're shadows. they're shadows. Okay, okay. They just look like skeletons. Yep, I just yep, think yep. anything magical, they need to be magical. Yep, yep, yep. It would be like that. Thank you so much. <laughs> nice. Good placement. Now, wait, don't they fly? Look at all those they shadows. Do. See what happens. Yeah, I'm gonna unhide on my turn. So that they come after me. Alright. Tom's the idiot. Uh oh. I was hoping they wouldn't do that. Yep. Oh, unaffected by a wall of thorns. Oh, no, they fly over it. Yep. All right. Well, there went that. Life yeah. drain. Got the life drain. Out, I can't turn, can you? Uh, nope. Not built that way. Oh, light sensitive? Are they light sensitive? It looks like they're light sensitive. They're light sensitive. Yes, they are. Nice. Good thing you lit those torches, huh? Yep. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. <laughs> God, if they're gonna fly really over it, we, if we, if, nice. if they're gonna fly over it, we might as well cancel that wall cancel of thorns. That'll oh, yeah, yeah. our I got, mobility. Yeah. I just gotta wait till yeah. my turn. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But dude, favorite enemy. That's badass. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Look at that. And I'm yeah. now hasted, and then next round, if I can get to enough of them, I'll battle focus. Mm -hmm. Oh, you'll be able to get enough to them because they're going to come to us. Yep, they will. All right. So what do I want to do? I got to switch swords again because cold isn't going to do any good. Or we'll fire. 
so. Uh, yeah. I have protection from evil up, so they are at a disadvantage to hit me. Nice. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. We're probably all in that aura, too. Nice. Just shy. Oh, uh, yeah. Do we have any mass AoE spells? Oh, they're on top of us. Ah. Really? He rolled double 18s. Oh, no. we can... Yeah. Half damage on strength base attacks. One round duration. I just I just can't believe that he rolled double eighteens on it on it. Yeah, double eight. Yeah. Is it, was that what he needed to hit too? Was yeah, exactly. That's exactly yeah. what he needed yeah. to hit. Yeah. Of course it was. Naturally. Of course it was. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Welcome to Tales of the Pythian, all in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's right. I think a lesser restoration heals that. I don't remember, though. I don't think that's... All right, let's see. Oh, this will get him. I think I can do. Oops. We're about to have a lot of shadows going after this. Yep. Yep. And I'll pack in yeah. tight. Yep. <laughs> oh, yeah. Never mind. I'll it will be a target-rich environment. Second. Yep. Okay. Mm. This is what we're doing. Do we have anything we can set down to make them take damage continuously? Uh, that was the oh, idea with the spikes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, there we go. You nice. Lose. That's actually a good idea. Even if we took some major damage from it. So, right, uh, right between you and Thomas. Oh, they Hugh took fire. Is on fire. Because all the line, all the thorns are on fire for some, yeah. That's cool. What did? Oh, you did a wall of fire. Okay. It took massive. Yeah, I did a damage. wall of fire in a circle. I'll fix the damage. Who let the dogs out? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, nice. Your sex is on fire. Uh. Nice. Yeah, I can't just turn in it. Oh, there's... Oh, yeah. Huh. Nice. And he's highlighted. Nice. Awesome. Highlighted. Crap. This is going to be bad. That's why it's in my primary hand. The ability to potentially highlight three targets. Well, I mean, they're all going to be attacking at disadvantage now. Yeah, regardless, they are regardless because of the wall of fire. Problem, of course, being is block. Well, it being an evoker with a thunder wave. That'd be great right here. <laughs> Be oh, brutal. pockets of safety? I don't hit my friends? Like, what's this? Thunder wave. Yeah, there you go. Bane the fire? No. How could you swing and not hit one of them? Right. This is a bad, this is a bad situation. Saying. No, this is excellent. This is a target rich environment. This is what I've dreamed of. <laughs> I mean, he doesn't even have to sidestep to it. I could stay right here and kill four of them. Fair. Ah. Ah. 
two. Oh, whatever two. current is does not light it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I need some serious healing, by the way. Um, yeah. You know, it would have been worse if we didn't oh, wow. know this is what we were fighting. You got. You, yeah. I was gonna go where that shadow was. Right. And blocked me off. Yeah. So, give me a hot second here. I have to hit you this way. Uh. Natura, evo, curee. Really? I mean, you're dead. Uh, wow. Okay, I feel well. like it's most beneficial to cast them individually at one level because you get your bonus plus each die roll, oh. and they don't have the opportunity to screw you yeah. out of a third level spell. They don't have the opportunity to screw you. But regardless, like you did, what was the healing? It was 11. How did that comprise? What? Uh, did it say what you rolled? I'm trying to scroll over it now. It doesn't show you. It'll show you damage, but it doesn't show you healing. Huh? Yeah. But no, if you scroll over like 10 fire or right above it from shadow, it'll show you all the rolls. But you should have at least what, a plus three to heal, right? So you would have rolled an eight. I'm just trying to figure out where the hell I took all this damage from with the fire. Natura. Angel. Malmis. You'll die like the rest. Oh, good enough. Immune. Yeah, but that piercing damage from that spike is pretty awesome. Yeah. You know, you know where you took it from? The shadows. <laughs> the shadow knows. Yeah, come on, shadow. What you got? Anything? Is it that one? Uh, yeah, okay. Let's yeah. smack him. How dare Just you? Just bad luck. Three of them right here. Curran went to court and he did right on. Uh huh. Curran went to court and he did right on. Uh huh. Curran went to court and he did right. Got a sword stuck Go in his side. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Blammo, dude. Nice. Carry on. Carry on. Huh. Yes, sir. Aww. Yes, sir. And kill him. He's got another one. Yep. I'll do it. I win again. If there is <gasps> any way you can exit from that area, that would be awesome. Yeah, I was thinking, get up in here. <laughs> no, not that's what, I gotta well, get out of there. Like that, uh, but I, I mean... You, yeah, I was telling you that place was on fire. Oh. Yeah, he um, did, or, uh, Jose did that a little too close. Do you see really want me to get out of there? Oh, no, I did it on purpose well, so that Kern wouldn't have to move and they would stay there and take damage. Uh, what shocks me is that... Uh, I actually took that much damage from it, despite the Ring of Fire resistance, which shouldn't have... Yeah. You no, know, I'm not afraid of any one of these motherfuckers, and just to show you that... You're using my hit points anyway. <laughs> You're not gonna hit him. Y'all can feel free to move wherever you want. <laughs> Excuse me, coming through. Coming through. I'm sorry. I know the movie's oh, done, but coming through. Pardon me, dude. My bad. Unbelievable. 
You spilled your popcorn. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, so let's do this. Oh, y'all, I need some juju bees. I'm coming back that way. Watch your feet. <laughs> nice. Okay. Let's see. Guys. Yeah, I'm now I'm getting hungry. I want some popcorn. <laughs> we'll snack. I want some popcorn. More. More. Yep, that'll do. That will. That's definitely more. Yep, that's definitely more. That was more. Just made a hole for himself. Boom. Yeah. Well, when you sucked up all their opportunity attacks. Oh yeah. Fuck some popcorn. I want corn on the cob. Yeah. Weekend. Oh, <laughs> right. You fucker. All right, that guy's behind us. You can probably okay. cancel your wall of fire now. Yeah. Or five. Four left? Four. Yep. Oh, okay. Easy peasy. That weakened is a bitch, but at least it's only a round. Right. I feel like undead aren't as scary in 5th edition. Yeah. Well, yeah, they're really not. Well, they kind of are for this party, but, you know, for other for other parties... No, like, in older know. editions, they had, like, fear effects, you know? And yeah. Oh, nice. Level they were very unsettling. <laughs> like, level yeah, Everybody drain. succeeded. You know, period. Lose a level. That that's it. There's no save. You got like have to go get. Oh, like, whites back in the day. Level yeah. drain. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh wait. Do we have a light. We have light still, don't we? Yep. Yeah. Good point, Greg. I forgot about that. Yeah. Everything in fifth edition is like resolved with a long rest, right? Like there's almost nothing a long rest can't cure. That's bad. Yeah. Can't cure this broken heart. Come on, Shadow. What you got? Hit me. Oh, you should have hit me. You can hit me. You want to hit me? Uh, they ignored me and went right for you guys. Hey, I'm, about to, I'm about to play. I'm about to play while my blade gently weeps. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my weekend's gone. So. Oh, my guitar gently weeps. Uh, you know what? Fuck these guys. Oh. Wow. Fly like an eagle. <laughs> Till I'm free. <laughs> do, do, do. Do 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 do. Deal with it. Do 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 Oh, you've got a much lower AC as the eagle. It's okay. Did he still go with disadvantage? Yep. Yes, he did. Okay. Free the children. I don't have enough to eat. Enough to people. With no shoes on their feet. Do do do. I'm so honest. Confession: I used to play. Uh, there's World of Tanks. There's also World of Warplanes and World of uh, Warships. And I used yep. to play World of Warplanes, 
and you know the mission would start and i would type in like free the be fly like an eagle and i'd wait till i was fighting a dude and i would hit the enter the enter key and it would put that in the chat and i always thought like as the opponent you must be like damn dude this guy's flying and typing this shit what the fuck like <laughs> what the hell, man? and i would try to type shit and i had you know do 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 and people like shut the fuck up you know and i'm nailing them with rockets and missiles and i would just hit enter and i'd be like man it's got to be fucking with him and i'm typing with him as we dog fight like, <laughs> I know I would be like, what in the fuck? What the hell? How's he doing that? <laughs> this guy have four hands? Nice. He did. He did like it. He said his buddy will like it too. Ha! Ouch. Absolutely. Summon Curran. <laughs> Poor bastards. Look, my uh, portrait up in the carousel looks like a griffin. Doesn't look like an eagle. Yeah. that on that one yeah now it's a give us 20 now it gives you a 20. oh there's two left they've got like 10 percent hit points here have a 20 right <laughs> yeah, I I only see one left. have a 20 you earned it buddy <laughs> <laughs> good looking out oh punch him oh wait i guess <laughs> you don't have magical gauntlets do you i don't yeah. that's not gonna stop me from punching him no uh, i mean that'll stop me from punching him I don't want to punch you. Well, I mean, he's elevated, you know. Yeah, he's way up there. And you're vertically challenged. Vertically challenged. <laughs> Bye -bye. Keep them coming. Oh. Light is with us. Yeah, it is. Several long tables and chairs are here, all dusty but in good condition. Walls are plastered and decorated with scenes of horrid feasts in a banquet where shadows, ghouls, and vampires join the temple clerics and demons. Mm. That really doesn't sound very pleasant. Uh, I don't like that shit. I don't like this shit one bit. You just picked up lethargic. The detrimental can oh, that yeah. away. Yeah. Because my speed potion of speed wore off. Oh, okay. And I'm out of them now because they're trigger happy. Hey, they're there to be used, right? Yep. Oh, 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 hold up. We got a passage to the right, passage forward. Doors. A door over the right there. Are we still... 
healthy, temporary hit points. Are we still affected by pass without trace? I don't believe so, huh? No. No. I saw okay. Drop that. Hold on. Group up. And just uh, so. Group up. Action economy inventory. I've got uh, one second, one third, and four first level spells, and all my cantrips. Just so we all. And we need about 6,000 experience points to hit the ninth level. Nice. Another door. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is somebody's office. Go we'll check it all out. Is there anything in here? Any secret stuff? Nothing caught my eye. Catch this door next. All right, went in. I'll be cool, right being here. cool, man. I think you're. Uh, let's see here, Peter. I think you're sitting in the spot where I need to be to open the door. Yep. yep, I think Peter has to open it. Oh, let's move out of the way. Or that. Or that. Dancing on the ceiling. <laughs> oh, what a feeling. Oh, another door. Oh, we got a rest spot in here. Uh oh. Uh, we got a ghost. Be cool. Trying to Be get cool. out of range and I can't. Be cool, be cool. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh Ooh, nice. She got two initiative anyway. Hot. That is fire Poor initiative, bitch. guys. Two of us got 23s. One of us got a 22. One of us got 21. Uh, <laughs> it's fucking insane. Let's go wipe it out. Oh, did I stay hidden? I did. Nice. You did. I wrapped myself in metal. Damn, I'll tell you what. I was hidden fast without trace. And somehow she got you. You didn't get seen. Yeah, she, nah. yeah, no, no, yeah. she saw Tom. Well, I mean, no, I didn't trigger it. Right, right. But she, she detected me when she detected him. When they go to alert. Like, yep. when gotcha. they're passive. I just couldn't get back any further because Peter was standing on the wall and it wouldn't let me go any further. Like, I could walk right next to them skeletons when they weren't alerted, but if they came within three or four of me, once combat was triggered, they saw me. Yep. It won't let you walk. Because they're on high alert. That's crazy. Yeah, you should easily be able to get under me. That's messed up. It doesn't let you do that. I missed with a 19. Wow. That's uh, that's some serious AC there. Yep. <laughs> One lit. Okay, so that's somewhat affecting it. Done lit. Hmm. I had advantage with my surprise.
How about highlighted? That'll help. That'll help. That'll do. That'll definitely help. Oh, that'll really do. Nice. Dude. They should get in the turn. I don't think so. Holy no, smokes, man. Holy smokes. Brutal. Can they wow. use battle? Wow. Uh, Battle focus. Yeah. That's awesome. That's good night. 20. <laughs> Damn, advantage. Just like that. Yep. All day. That is a very nice short sword. I mean, advantage it mathematically turns your 5% crit chance into a 20%. I mean, it's a 10% yeah. crit chance. Yeah. It was covered with thick carpets, cushions spread about. Upon it lies a mummified body of an elf face down with the hilt of a dagger protruding from its back. Yeah. Uh, they must have this is magnesium. Right there. We bring light in dark. There's some magnesium, black gem, parapet. Uh, uh, scroll of remove curse and scroll of tongue. Ooh. Uh, Black gem periapt. So sending uh, basically all of that to uh, Barig. Uh, wait, Barig. remove curse should go to Peter. All right. And then tongues. I don't know. Y'all can. That's a kiss wizard. over it. That's a wizard's. <laughs> Y'all can kiss over it. Y'all play tongues over it. Fight over it. Let's see. Glad this is a long rest spot. We have a long rest spot. I have five rations. Well, okay. I'm not even tired. But you know what? If we all want to rest, I will. Ew. No tongues. Didn't like the tongues. <laughs> oh, damn it. Worf's on in the fillet. Yeah, I didn't know you were doing that. You used up my torch. And... I don't think there's anything else here for me to attune, so. about to notify him. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> have to make sure I validate my spells this time. I replaced your uh, <clears throat> torch. Okay. Light will guide us. Okay, bink. Oh, yeah. Uh, undead or present? Banshee. Okay. It says undead, present, banshee. <laughs> A little late on that one.
Dairy looks like it was once a kitchen. Moldy boxes of food and bottles of old stale wine litter the floor. I don't want it if it's stale wine. It's a corridor there. They smoke. Oh, 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 hold. <laughs> Contact. That's what I meant to say. Contact. Bugbears. Bugbear archers. Three archers. Two bugbears I can see. There's a Ooh, doorway looks like behind. You got him from behind. <clears throat> All right. All right. I'm just gonna hit him I'm with my bow. Behind you here. All right. Y'all ready? Ready? No. No. Ready? Hold on. Get spotted. Oh, you went for the attack right off the bat. Well, that's a nice uh, clutch, you know. Oh my god, that's awesome. <laughs> I don't believe it. <laughs> Sneak attack. <laughs> oh, poisoned him. Nice. Yep, he's got his poison up. <sighs> oh, that's awesome. Uh, ogres are going to be through the door, I bet. <laughs> they can't get in. Oh, here. If we can plug <laughs> the door away, we're in I told him. Shape. I told him, no, 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 I'm not ready. Okay, now I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can hear the ogres. Oh, whatever's coming at us is coming from those other rooms. Yep. Yeah, well, we're behind the archers. We did this right. Oh, we hit the we hit this from the right direction. Look, I'm next to the archers. We did this right. Yep. Uh, chief what I do there. all depend on what Jose does. Ogres are out there. Yeah. What am I going to do? What are you going to do? What am I going to do? What am I going to do? What about that six person Solasta mod? We should contact that dude to play test for him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, be right. honest we, had, we had enough people on the up. other night. You can hit him up. He's on my friends list. You know, he's a guy from Brazil. Let's do that. Beautiful. That's exactly what I was Don't hoping you would killed. do. <laughs> nice. Yup. Oh, that is exactly what I was hoping you would do. Holy smokes. I mean, you usually get smoke with fire. <laughs> yep. 
I just can't believe we got surprise on it. Oh, ah, no, moron. <laughs> Really? Oh, you actually what did four? that, huh? Wow. What the? Wow. Well, of course we got surprised with that current trigger the combat. Yeah. Right. You had a bad day. gonna do now besides die ogre i got all these hit points ah. he's going aggressive wait why can't i attack dude too far away gotta yeah. go one more forward got one more really it won't let me go one more forward difficult terrain oh. probably are you fucking shitting me no nope. Yeah, it is just difficult terrain. I don't like this one bit. Alright. Fuck him. Let's maximize effectiveness. Let's cast Hunter's Mark. Devo Malmis. Alright, you know, that's actually not a bad idea. And then let's ready. Fuck you. Poison blades and shit, and I couldn't get to my man. <laughs> <laughs> what in the fuck? I had both my weapons poisoned for like one minute. It yeah, probably took me thirty seconds to pull that off. Evil mouth. You're oh. not coming back. Oh, nice. Oh, it's gonna be brutal. All right, I'm that playing is. a caster next time. That's awesome. Yeah, uh, Jose is about to yeah. brutalize everything. That's awesome. Fuck you, Jose. Fire and ice, baby. <laughs> Fire and ice. I love that was it. a beautiful mark. Boom. It was a beautiful... Boom. He takes another one. Yep. Come on, come get swung on. Come here! <laughs> <laughs> come on! Boom! Oh, he oh. threw a javelin. Walk it um, off. Suck us. Oh, man. Come on! Oh. <laughs> All to die. I'm the most barbarian ranger you've ever seen. Yeah, really. You're almost dead, though. Holy shit. And if I step like one more in this fire, I'll probably take 33 and die. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Why? Oh shit, dude. Come on now. Yeah, really. That's so silly. I want to hold position here because that's like 20 feet where that thing burns out. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, we'll get it. Get it. One. Get it. There it goes. Poison. Finally got it. And he'll kill himself on that one. Oh, no. He's going to attack. Then he'll die. Miss. Oh. 
Oh, that's is that a the, hit. That's the chieftain, isn't oh. it? Yeah. Oh. All right. Was a chieftain. Was a chieftain. Was. <laughs> There's another archer in there. Take that. Natura. Evo. Cure. Oh, much appreciated. The third. Yeah, you'll need it. <laughs> Alright, I get to hit. Get out of this. Cause you're still in the fire right there. Yeah, go one more. Yeah, the fire is still there. That should be safe. Oh. No problems. Oh. Yep. As you say, that should be safe. Well, where are you uh... going? Yeah, uh, the way uh, Jose lined it up. I was up, trying to get like... next to these uh, shield bearers. That would be ideal if I were next to both of y'all. <laughs> uh, I could target one of these assholes. And then what I really should do... Oh. Move one more, yeah. Uh, no, let's do this. That works. Nope, no, 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 no. Let's go back and let's do that. Natura Evo Jure. There you go. There you go. Oh, I'm a ranger. I can heal. Thirty four. Thirty four <laughs> between the two of you. That's pretty good. That's not bad. Here. Let me, uh, let me up that 40 more. <laughs> there you go. That's right. Yeah, and now it's just overkill. <laughs> all in. Jose's all in. All in. Yep. Jose's got a five and a six, and he's all in. <laughs> That's right. nope. we, we, we split the pot one time because all three of us had a fucking five and a six, three ways, like, and everybody <laughs> put their ass off. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, that's awesome. I've never ever in my life seen that. Yeah. Uh, three people split the pot three ways. Three and ways. everybody have a five and a six. Nobody really had shit. At all. Worst river, worst hand ever. <laughs> like, really? And people were betting their fucking asses off. Natura, Evo, Cure. Or what started out as a forty dollar pot. I'll remember. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. Bam. Yes, sir. Oh, that that sounded painful. Yep. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. <coughs> the other one's still Man. making his way. They're a little slow. Yeah, I don't think he's going to come. Yeah, it won't matter. He said. Yep. He's doomed. His fate has been written. Both of those statements is what she said. <laughs> I don't yep. think he's going to come. <laughs> it won't matter. <laughs> it won't matter. <laughs> uh, I amuse myself. Alright, uh. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 that's not what I want. I want this. I'm gonna get an attack, you motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> He came. Ah! He did. Oh my god. <laughs> that was a good hit. Necro Malmes. Uh 
Oh, bad plan. Oh. Hmm. Thomas gets to be the ogre slayer. Oh, Maybe. rock at him. That's gonna cost me some damage, though. Beats. Oh, oh man. Have fun in there. Again, oh, I did. What? Okay, I was about to say. Fifteen seventy-five. That's respectable. How much damage do you guys do in that <laughs> last fight? How much what? Is it how much damage do you guys do in that last fight? Not much. No, not much. Oh, three javelins plus one. Nice. Is that a new poison? Aravat's kiss? Uh, don't know. Who wants the javelins? Anybody up for them? I do not need them. Natura, I don't need them. Oh, yeah. Uh, I carry javelins. It wouldn't hurt. Uh, wait. They're, uh, they're better suited on a strength I build on finesse. Them. Yeah. Watch if I like to throw shit with bonus actions. So we should uh, we should probably head back to the room, to re the restroom, uh, so we can save out for the stream. For yeah. Tonight. Yep. Right that oh, time. Right. What time is Are it? You guys don't oh shit! It? Yeah, it flew by. It flew by. Okay. Yeah, it went by quick. Okay, we got it. Suddenly the door. Oh. <laughs> no. Okay. Silver was oh, like, oh, so yeah, after, you get one more fight in you. Yeah. yeah, after this fight. Yeah. Or I wanted to I wanted to fight Scorp and Splot anyway. Yeah. <laughs> going, Damn. Let's see. Shows me here. Let's see if it's lying to me. Yeah, four and a half minutes. T minus. Let's see. Well, I was actually thinking about like yep. doing more, like except in a different spot because there's more to this level than you guys know. Don't worry, so no. we'll play Baldur's Gate 3. Yeah. Know <laughs> uh, oh what? I think that giant can't fit through that little doorway. Probably not. It's, uh, what is it, a 3x3? Three three, or is it yeah, a 2x3? Yeah, he's three? a 3x3. Three it's a shame he grew so big in that room. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, the uh, first... Remember I said these maps are designed exactly according to first edition. So I designed them exactly according to first edition. So this uh, doorway is 10 foot by 10 foot. Except fifth edition, it looks like they increased the, they increased the size of the hill giants to 3 by 3. It's a 2 by 2. He's blocked. Yeah, it's a narrow. Never hit this encounter this way either. So normally, uh... hmm, hmm, hmm. All right, we'll just do this. Arcana, evil, very bad. Ooh. Nice. Oh, yeah. Poor Scorp. Scorp got blazed. Yeah, where is Scorp? <laughs> Scorp, you've been blazed. Uh, Jose, I think, if I'm not mistaken, Flaming Sphere, it's a bonus action to attack with the sphere, right? Correct. Oh. Yes, bonus action. To so in sphere. Baldur's Gate 3, there are items that, like, there's a helmet that if you're below 50% health, you get an extra bonus action. Oh, so so cool. you could attack with Flaming Sphere again. You know? Oh, hell 
If you had it out there, you could strike with it again. Splot is a what? Is that a so, bear? Oh, so what you could do is you can cast your spear, stand in it until you're 50% down, and then throw it into attack. Well, all right, let's take it a step further. You're a sorcerer. And you have twin spell, and you they can cast, cast two flaming light. sphere, and then with the same piece of equipment, you'd have an extra bonus action, and you could attack with each one on your turn. Kill it, Kermit. Nice. Two different areas. I don't think, let's see, the flaming sphere, I'm going to take damage if I end there, not if I'm standing there, right? Correct. Uh, if you end there. And you can walk okay. through it. Okay. Yeah. You can walk through it with no problem. More coming your way. Nice. Oh, nice. I like it. Huh. Looks like he can take a few hits. Yep. Definitely. Let's see here. That's battle. Ooh. Oh, that still hit? Okay, nice. Yeah. Yeah, Ooh. seven. Smacking on him, man. And that was a seven and a one. So, yeah, we yeah. avoided a crit miss and turned it into a hit. Oh, my God. Look at that. With the highlighted. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, I told... Over quick, he told he taught me the value of fairy fire. Missed, like, oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I didn't really like fairy fire before. Now the whole thing is, it's even more powerful when it's delivered through a weapon hit. Oh. You know, and not having to like just spend your turn oh. casting fairy fire. Yeah, but delivered through a weapon hit is amazing. Yeah, it's pretty. It is. It's great. I could see easily overlooking that and not seeing it for what it was. I would likewise like to see Dazzle applied to a weapon. Oh yeah. Oh, that's interesting. And so many people would overlook take, that. Take that. Like yep, Dazzle? Pff, I've never used that. Yeah, yeah. and you're missing out. <laughs> like that's the one thing I wish Balrig had right now is Dazzle. That's been really handy in our last in our other game. Mean, oh yeah. Not wish. I mean, if I had the wish, I would wish for dazzle. So I guess. A <laughs> <laughs> uh, well played, sir. Good night, Scorp. Good night, Scorp. I have this four shotgun. It's yeah, called a. Uh, it's <laughs> B. B. Nali M9? I, I don't know. Uh, um, I think Splot's days are done. Oh yeah, we got this going. Dirty. We might as well give him this. Yep. I don't. Yeah, I don't want to disrespect him. <laughs> nice. No quarter given. Nice. Really? Oh. With the advantage? Wow. Yeah. Oh. It, one and a two. Oh, that's just jacked well, up. Well, all right. I was paying more attention to this chest to my left. 
Yeah, it's right Squad next door. <laughs> Is that treasure, I see? Really? Oh, yeah. A one hit point, huh? Peter the Splot Killer. Splot Killer. <laughs> Do not worry. <laughs> hey, 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 Peter, Peter. Hey, Peter, you missed a splot. You missed a splot. <laughs> Wait till the that next time. One. Sweet. <laughs> Good win. All right, now if we just quickly engage this other combat. So, <laughs> <laughs> when we come back, when we come back next week, we'll be 3,500 uh, away from ninth level. Like we get, we picked oh, up there's a lot another, of experience there's, points. This uh, picked up a lot of the potion of speed. Oh for fuck! We have nope. failed to open this chest. Two of us. It's not there looking it good. Oh, we got it! We got it! All right. If I just quickly uh, throw a dagger in this guy's head. Uh, uh. Oh, there's a Get lot of a lot of money, a bunch of gems, and one um and a, and another healing potion. Do you guys okay. want to? Do you want to just save it in this room, as opposed to going all the way back, or do you want to go? Yeah, all we way can back? save it right in this room. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, if we go all the way back, we end it there. We do a rest, and we're good to go at the beginning. We don't have to do any of that stuff. So that's yeah, that's well, good. we could also do that off camera idea. before the next session if we need to. Whatever, you know. True. Yeah. True. Yeah. True. That's gonna work. We got all the treasure out of here, so okay. So in this room, then. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll end in this room. All right. all right. Yeah, you can end the stream in this room. Then we'll just run back to that last one. So. Save it. I'll save it after we end. All right. We're out of here. Uh, next Sunday, are we one to four or are we eight to eleven? Oh, next Sunday is eight to eleven again, eight and then after 11, that, okay. the next the next three will be one to four. Yeah. All right. So next Sunday, eight to eleven, we'll be here. This will be on YouTube. You should come here, and we're out of here. So, see ya. See Have a good night. See ya. Oh, look at all that gold.